Hello, here's how I make the sourdough. So now I have my um, sourdough. <clears throat> it's been sitting out all night. And I'm gonna go ahead and grab a wooden spoon. You can get plastic if you want. Um, it's bubbly, it's foamy. I'm just going to stir it around a little bit. And I'm going to put it, I just have this plastic bowl because um, I can't do it in a metal. I'm going to pour about half of this into the bowl to make the sourdough. And the other half I'm going to just pour into a clean jar and I'm going to feed it again. And now I'm going to take all-purpose flour and just a half a cup and feed my um, sourdough and set that back aside. This, I'm gonna feed it. With flour and about a fourth cup of water filtered. And stir that around. And it'll just kind of look like this. I don't like metal touching it, so I'm gonna go ahead and put a filter on it. The lid. <clears throat> I'm not going to tighten this because it'll expand, so just let it let it be able to have air. I just sit it on top. And now I have self-rising flour because that's the only thing I could make work. And I'm going to add two cups of self-rising flour to my sourdough starter. It smells so good already. Now I'm going to add about a half a cup of water. Um, I could be wrong. I might have to add more. I'm just gonna mix it. So it's just the sourdough starter, bread flour, no, I'm sorry. Sourdough starter, self-rising flour, and water. Okay, probably gonna need a whole cup. See, <laughs> I forgot measurements. I'll just do it until it looks good. Mix it up, mix it up, mix it up. It's starting to form, and then you just want to kind of flip it. You can do this with your hands, but it's extremely messy. So I'm just going to start folding it over. And I do that for a while, probably like two minutes. Okay, I've folded it. Not too much, because sometimes it seems like if you fold it, See, I fold it into a, just keep folding it over into a ball. But I think if you do it too much, it might make the bread hard. So, done with that. And then, this is my favorite dish. This is my little bread dish. I don't know if you can see it. I'm going to add a little olive oil to the bottom. Ooh, nice. I just woke up. And just Smear that around to grease it a little bit, and then I'm going to pour my, I'll use that for my hands because it's so good. Okay. Just dump your um, bread in here. Oh, it's so foamy. It's so good. Okay, last, you're going to take a little bit of um, this flour and put it, just sprinkle it on your, your dough to give it, now it's it's got dough on, it has um, flour on the top. That's so nice. I can't see, I have this camera backwards. But then you have to, um, I forgot what this is called, but you have to um, put a slit in it so when it it'll give it room to rise. And you could just make little designs. I like making like flowers and stuff. Veronica likes to put I love you and cute things like that. Here's my little design, if you can see it. And then take it and get a tea towel 
and just put it over for the night. Uh, about, I'll let this sit for probably 12 or 14 hours. So I, I probably um, <clears throat> did this at a bad time because that'll be the middle of the night. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed.